So we finally made it, about to head in uh, to our reservation and get set. A bit of stuff that we got from the salad bar. Right here we have pande cast, which is like a cheese bread. It's really good. So now we have the salad. We're going to wait for the um, guys to come with the meat. So once you flip these red cards over to the other side to green, then the guys just start coming consistently with a bunch of different types of meat, which is really great. So let's turn it over and see. This. I'm not going to waste my appetite on anything but meat. Storyblocks Audio. So after all that food, and I mean, it was a lot. You can see we pretty much went through quite a bit of stuff here. Finishing up with a little bit of fruit, get the check, and then maybe head to the park with the baby. See if he wants to get on a swing for a little bit. But the food was amazing as usual. We definitely will come back. All right, so we just left over the child. We're gonna take the baby to a toy store. The food was delicious. Uh, it's probably my second time so far coming this year. We went last year for my birthday around this time, which was really nice. So, but Olivia was pregnant, so she couldn't really get a chance to eat much. Uh, so this time she got a chance to fully indulge in like a salad bar, eat all the meats, uh, medium rare, which is the way she typically likes it. So it was a good chance for her to really experience it for the first time. So yeah, now we're gonna go ahead to the toy store and let baby Jen kind of look around and see if he's seen things that he likes. And if so, maybe we'll grab something. What do you think, baby Jean? Ready for some toys? All right, let's go, buddy. So we just made it to FAO Schwartz. Take baby Jen to kind of see what they have here for him. A ton of cool displays in the windows. It's a really cool store. I haven't been here in a long time. Uh. <laughs> Should we take a picture with you guys with her? Thank you.
Thank you. Hello. We have an elevator next to Iron Studio. It's okay. going to take it all the floors. Thank you. Okay. Have fun, guys. Hey, baby Jean. Like some baby drones here. Like an old school jack in the box. Oh. Go back there, she was back there. Baby Jane, see any cars you like? Hmm? <laughs> Got some keychains here. Bunch of fire trucks. I used to love these when I was a kid. It looks like a bunch of candy. Just too young for all this stuff, but it looks pretty cool. Back here is a bunch of just candy and stuff, junk food, bad for your teeth. The 
this can be a real lollipop. That's just huge. Uh, okay. So we're hopping in the elevator, going to the second floor. See what they have up there. Pretty cool store. It's not too crowded for a Sunday even. Uh, even though the weather is pretty nice out, so that's good. We can kind of push the stroller and not be in people's way and vice versa, so it's pretty comfortable. There we go. Oh, we got Winnie the Pooh, baby Jane. Which one you like? Taylor. Looks like neither. Maybe penguin. One of my favorite animals. I don't think he cares much. <laughs> oh, got some Sesame Street stuff in the back for you, baby Jen. Some little costumes when it gets a little bit older. Kids love to walk around in costumes, even when it's not Halloween. So. No. <laughs> you wear it. It can fit you. Okay. Big bird. Like 
This is for me. Nothing makes him like too excited. <laughs> the lobster, I think. Connections that come with them in the box. Not Bluetooth connections or magnet connections or remote controls or propellers. Actual physical connections based on the magic trick. You can even take a coin, like this coin right here, and you can sneak it onto your Zordi connection. That's the connection that was making that thing fly. And then you can take a borrowed coin and you can do that with it. And that makes that fly, which looks pretty cool. Or fly, as they would say. Because it doesn't look possible. It's solid money. It's floating in midair. It shows you everything. If you're around ages 8 to adult, coin not included. That's pretty much it. We went from top to bottom, both floors. Pretty cool store. Alright, so we just left the toy store, went to head to the park with the baby for a little bit. And probably after that, just call it a day. So, see you guys at the park. Alright, so we finally made it to Central Park here. We're gonna just take a little walk around. 
see if we can still catch some cherry blossoms and maybe take Jen to the park to hop on a swing. So you got a lot of horse and carriage rides you can take here in the city. Never done that before, but I'm pretty sure it's pretty expensive, like everything else. Cool, we got the camera thing on here. Mm -hmm. Do they have any holders you can buy? They have a few different types. So I know like on this side, it's like a, usually like a lot of steps, which is kind of hard for the stroller, but we'll see. Right. So look, there's a little bit of cherry blossoms left here. I think these are cherry blossoms. Right there. I don't know. Can't tell. Let's see. Very nice day out, weather's perfect. We're like 68 degrees Fahrenheit. Right. We go to the right, head to the east side. Uh, I think that's uh, south. Let me check the map. There's obviously, here towards these buildings, and it's to the west side here, baby. You can see. Oh, okay. Hmm. So, going south is obviously straight, and then we'll go to the right, east. Sure. Let me get a view of the uh, tennis court mm -hmm. over here. You can see a pretty clear, unobstructed view of the tennis courts. Looks like they're doing some work over here. Wow, what a great view in the background. Beautiful. <coughs> right, we're gonna head down to this pond over here. Check out the ducks for a little bit. It's been a while since we've been to this part of the park. I hope it can 
next. Got a lot of stairs that side. I'm hoping it goes around so we can bring the stroller pretty easily, but <laughs> yeah. have to see. I feel like it does, it's just a, long, a way longer way. I feel almost... Turtles here sitting on this rock. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit, maybe. Turtle, there has a kid that's petting a turtle oh, really? on the rock. Yeah. You want to pet it? <laughs> sure. Regen can pet it. Oh. Do you want to see the duck? Ducky. Look at the turtle. Look. <laughs> turtle. See. Want to touch it? No, he's scared. You scared <laughs> of the turtle? Turtle's not gonna hurt you. Nah. <laughs> oh, he touch it! Oh, you, you touch it! Be gentle, okay? So a native meadow, I haven't been here before, so first time I gotta check it out, see what's inside. like much actually but it's still nice. Do you have butterflies here? Maybe not yet. Maybe with like when it's a little bit warmer probably get a chance to see something. Mm -hmm. Nice view. Yeah pretty good view. That's our park, I think, right? So close, so far. I guess we could take this all the way down. That's the park. So we're pretty much where we want to be. Stairs. Yes.
made it. Not that bad. coming across here to the park on the left that we take Jen to from time to time. Olivia takes him during the week a lot of times when I'm at work. Still young, he's only 10 months, but he can still like get on a baby swing, which he likes. But today it looks extremely crowded, so I think we might just pass on today and start heading back towards the apartment. Yeah, there's a lot of kids here today, it's crazy. A lot of strollers inside. So yeah, I think that'll probably be it for today's video. Did quite a bit of things. Went to Florida de Chow, Brazilian Steakhouse, then to the toy shop, FAO Schwartz, and then headed to the park for a little stroll. So it pretty much completes our Sunday. Thank you guys for tuning in. Bye. Bye.